In this video, I'm going to show you how to do Facebook marketing in real estate. As social media is booming today, every marketer should take advantage of social media platforms such as Facebook since there are lots of potential clients you can find here. Before you create your posts, you must first create your Facebook business page. We do have a separate video on how to properly create a business page. Make sure you watch it. As you have created your page, you may now start to invite people so that everything you post will be seen by these people. You may want to find 5 people every day to build rapport, connect and prospect, as they may know someone and refer you a potential client if they're not looking to buy. Find groups in real estate and join them, as you can post your contents here. This group has the same interest and your potential customer might see your post in these groups. Here are some posts from real estate business pages. It shows an open house promotion with details and multiple pictures of the house. This one is a social proof of this agent's sold property, showing people of the agent's credibility. This strategy is free. You may post valuable contents and share tips so that people may know that you're an agent and when they are looking to buy a house, they might go to you for help. You may also post your listings to Facebook's marketplace. As you browse, you may view the list of current for sale properties here. If you want to add your listing, click Sell Something button, input the details, add photos, then post it. Widen your audience reach. If you have the budget, you may start using Facebook ads. Some useful tips to remember before you create your ad. Know the right audience you want to target as you market. Localize your target. Choose a good, clear picture or video for your listing or your ad. List the short description you want people to know about your post. And prepare a good landing page. Go to your Facebook's business manager. Create the ad campaign. You may set it to traffic or lead generation. Let's create a sample ad. You may name this according to what location you want to target. Set the location of the real estate you are targeting. You may want to consider that people might be visiting a location where they are looking for a place to buy and they might be living from another city. They could be people recently traveling in this location. So it's better to choose everyone in this location. You may see the potential reach here. Click on the drop down arrow from this location. Choose current city only. We may even target audiences with a range of income. Browse the demographics, financial, then choose an option. As for interest, we may choose real estate. Placements. Let's choose feed so our potential buyers will see the ad as they scroll the news feed. Budget. It depends on how much you can invest in real estate. You may choose daily budget or a lifetime budget. For daily budget, you can go as low as $5 a day. And for lifetime budget, you can set up, for example, $150 a month. When you're done, just click continue. Remember, the more specific your target, the more it costs per lead. Facebook implemented a policy that pages with running housing ads must self-identify as a special ad category, housing opportunity. Ads that promote or directly link to a housing opportunity or service, including home or apartment. Targeting using special ad category will be limited for locations, age, gender, and detailed targeting. To conform with this policy, the way of targeting you can do is by creating a custom audience. As soon as your business page has a huge number of followers and your previous clients are here, you want to give this custom list of audiences or your followers to Facebook as they are going to be your target for your ads. Here's an overview of the ideal contents of an ad. Let's search for a sample real estate Facebook ad. Include some emojis so it entices an emotion in your marketing. A short description will help the buyers know at a glance the important details of the house. A good picture that would wow the buyer and say in his mind, I want this, with a limited text on the image. Facebook has a policy on posting photos and ads, as it must be 20% of the whole image. You may use Facebook's tool text overlay to check if your image has 20% or less text. 
Include a call to action. This is the most important part of your ad. If a potential buyer is hooked and interested to buy, this is the first thing you would want to do. Go to your landing page where they can type their name, email address, and contact number. Let's take a look at a few example posts from real estate pages. This page shares tips. Giving valuable information to people will help them and see you as the authority. They can go to ask for help when the time comes, they will buy a new house. Posts with videos. This gives better engagement from potential buyers and would likely to click on this video since videos catch most people's attention. This business page posted a link outside Facebook directing clients to a virtual tour of the house. This page shows multiple listings. It gives the potential buyers the options from choosing the right home for them. Using Facebook in marketing in a real estate niche will help the company or agent to promote, advertise their for sale properties on a budget. It is a cost-effective way to generate leads and land potential clients. Buying a property is a huge decision for the client. You may want to build your trust to your potential clients as they would want to buy from someone they like and trust. This will make you stand out from your competition. Make your listings and ads simple. Having a clear call to action. Lastly, testing your ads first with a minimum budget will save you time and money. Thank you for watching. You may visit our website at technicforce.com. We create cutting edge internet marketing tools to help make you a successful internet marketer, including video marketing tools, social media marketing, email marketing tools, SEO, e commerce tools, and WordPress internet marketing plugins. Check us out!